Good day viewers and welcome to the Polymer Update Daily News Show. This is Simran Chaudhary from the Polymer Update Mumbai office. Today's special news reel is sponsored by Mumbai based Met Asia Private Limited, an entrepreneurial metal scrap trading and indenting company for ferrous and non ferrous metals based in Mumbai. The company has successfully developed a global network of dependable suppliers with an unparalleled track record of reliability, authenticity, market know how, and financial capabilities. Let's start with energy news. Crude futures displayed a mixed undertone on Thursday on the back of a sharp fall in US crude inventories on one hand, while on the other, there is a possibility of OPEC taking a decision to boost output at their scheduled meeting on the 22nd of the month. WTI traded at $66.89, a rise of $0.25 cents per barrel. Brent, on the other hand, finished at $75.94, down $0.80 cents per barrel. Open spec NAFTA prices gained on Thursday and were assessed at the $661 US dollars per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels, a day-on-day -day increase of $6 US dollars per metric ton. Moving on to feedstock news. Ethylene prices climbed in Asia on Thursday. The price rise was a result of strong demand trends and persistent trite product availability in the region. CFR Southeast Asia prices of ethylene were assessed up at the 1,255 US dollars per metric ton levels, a gain of 15 US dollars per metric ton from Wednesday's assessed levels. CFR Northeast Asia prices of ethylene were assessed higher at the 1,365 US dollars per metric ton levels, a day-on-day -day increase of 5 US dollars per metric ton. Let's take a look at futures on China Dalian Commodity Exchange for today. On June 15, 2018, LLDPE prices are lower by 15 RMB per metric ton from the previous settlement at 9,215 RMB per metric ton. PP rates are down by 16 RMB per metric ton from the previous settlement at 9,286 RMB per metric ton. PVC prices are lower by 20 RMB per metric ton from the previous settlement at 6,920 RMB per metric ton. In plan news, Haldia Petrochemicals Limited is likely to resume production at its polyethylene and polypropylene plants following a maintenance turnaround. The plants were shut on May 10, 2018 for maintenance. Located at Haldia in the eastern Indian state of West Bengal, the complex has a 330,000 metric ton per year HTPE plant, a 370,000 metric ton per year HTPE LLDPE swing plant and a 350,000 metric ton per year polypropylene plant. Polymer Update has come up with monthly automobile industry insights for India as a value addition for its customers. The monthly report prepared by our in-house experts provides a 360-degree overview of the local automobile industry including regulatory issues, technological development, key international issues and latest trends affecting the industry. Visit polymerupdate.com to download the detailed report. That's all for today's Polymer News. Watch our daily news video on Monday to know more. It's Friday, June 15th. This is Simran Chaudhary. Thank you. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash polymerupdate and be sure to click the like button. You can also find us on Twitter at polymerupdate. For the latest news from the plastics and petrochemicals industry, subscribe to our YouTube channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon.